Okay, so right now I'm going to tell you about all my favorite phase three foods. It's going to be kind of a longer video. Sorry. So what I did is um, I ordered this maintenance sampler pack. And the maintenance sampler pack comes with like, I have it on my desk right here. And it's kind of overwhelming. <laughs> it comes with um, a whole bunch of um, protein bars, mixes, things like that, that you can try on maintenance and then after the fact. So they are allowed. Um, they're lower sugar, lower carbs, so they're even allowed in the first three weeks of maintenance. But they come with all this stuff, and I actually got to try it and pick my favorites out, and now I buy full boxes of my favorites. So I'm just going to kind of go through and tell you what my favorite products are. Um, PB2 is powdered peanut butter, and I actually did a video just on the jar um, because it is available in a jar as well. But this is what comes in the sampler packet. It's one, so you can kind of try it to see if you like it. Basically, powdered peanut butter is a peanut butter powder that you mix with water. So you can have a peanut butter type consistency. So it is really great for maintenance um, just because it is lower calorie. And then, of course, it doesn't have over the grams of sugar or carbs allowed. Um, it also comes with Miracle Noodles, which I did another vi video on, which are a really good pasta replacement for phase three. And with this bag is two servings. I use them and I'm not even on phase three anymore. So they're really good. And then I have all my favorites. So I'm not going to go through everything that came with it. Um, most of the protein bars were good. I'm not really super big on the protein bars. So I liked some of the other products, which I'm going to go over. But when you get this kit, you'll kind of figure out your favorites. And then you can order full boxes of it, which is what I did. So first, I'm going to go through this one. This is... The chocolate flavored fudge cake, and my box is a little dented, but this is what it looks like. And when it's out, it's just a little bitty packet. And you mix this with water and you microwave it, and it literally makes like a chocolate cake. It is delicious. And this picture, mine's usually a little bit more runny than that, because if you microwave it like 10 seconds less than it tells you to, it's like a molten chocolate lava cake in the middle, and it's a little doughy. So that's really good, and it's allowed on the first three weeks, and I kind of have a sweet tooth sometimes for chocolate. So this is really good. Um, a couple of my other favorite products that I discovered from this um, maintenance sampler pack are these pancakes. These are actual pancakes that the main ingredient, the very first ingredient, is whey protein. So they're, they have a little bit of flour in them, but not enough to push it over the carb count for allowing it on the first three weeks of maintenance. But like I said, their main, um, the first ingredient is protein. So there is like 15 grams of protein per pouch. And the pouches just look like this as well. Um, they're the Protein Diet brand. The pancakes come in blueberry and then just like a regular flavor. I like the blueberry, of course. <laughs> so um, my next one would probably be the oatmeal that you can get from the website. Basically, it looks like this as a packet. But the same thing. Oatmeal is not allowed on phase three especially during the first three weeks because it is a starch. But the very first ingredient in this is a whey um, protein isolate sodium caseinate blend. So it is allowed um, one packet, one little packet, has 15 grams of protein. So it helps you get in your protein um, intake while keeping calories and sugars and starches low. This is the maple flavor. They also have an apple cinnamon flavor. This one's definitely my favorite. And then next, I would say, is these dark chocolate wafers. Um, when you get the sampler pack, it comes with three different types of wafers. This is what they look like on the inside. They're kind of shiny. And it's vanilla, mocha, and dark chocolate. Like you saw with the fudge cake, chocolate is kind of one of my crutches. So these dark chocolate wafers are really good. Um, same thing, the first ingredient is a protein blend. So it's not made primarily with flour, so it is allowed on the first three weeks. Um, it does have a little bit of sugar and carbs in it, so don't eat like five a day and start really slow. Um, when I got this, I only started with one product a day, and then I monitored how my bo my body and my weight did before I started eating more than one a day. Um, now I can usually eat two to three a day without having an issue, so I won't eat three of these, but I'll eat like the oatmeal in the morning and then like these, this as a snack, and then maybe a protein bar after dinner. So this one's really good. Like I said, it's the dark chocolate wafer. They're kind of like a cookie. They're really good. 
And then next is the zippers. And when you get them, they look like this. So just a little packet. And these are the barbecue zippers. And same thing, first ingredient is protein. There is 15 grams of protein in this little thing and only 150 calories. If you like chips, I would say try to switch to these during maintenance. Chips aren't allowed. These are a protein blend. Um, there's only like one gram of sugar per packet. It's really good. So um, stick with these. They're crunchy. They make you feel like you're not on maintenance. So. And then the last thing is very dear to my heart. They're chocolate flavored soy snacks. And when you get them in the pack, they look like this. And they're literally like little malt balls covered in chocolate. They don't really have a malty flavor. It's just kind of like, I said malt balls. So it's kind of like a powdery inside with the chocolate coating. They're really good. The first ingredient is a soy protein isolate. So it is um, allowed during the first three weeks of, of phase three, even though you can't have a lot of sugars and starches. Um, there's 15 grams of protein per it. And they are really good for being such a protein-based. Sometimes protein-based things have kind of like a weird aftertaste. This does not have that. So this is really good. I eat these quite a bit. I go through too many boxes. Um, but I really like them. So in regards to all these foods, some of the things are made with soy. So look at the ingredients if you do have um, a soy allergy before you purchase them. But they're really good. And then all the things, I didn't go through everything in here. But there are other things that come in that sampler pack like five different protein bars, and then um, it comes with the other flavor of pancake mix and then the other flavor of oatmeal. And like I said, I try to live a high protein lifestyle even though I haven't been on maintenance for quite a while, and it's been working well, and I've been maintaining my weight. So um, I think that's all, and I hope everyone has a great day. Bye.